Hi everyone and welcome to the enchanting world of jellyfish. Get ready to dive into a sea of fun facts and fascinating insights about these captivating creatures. With their translucent bodies and graceful movements, jellyfish are like living works of art floating through the water. Prepare to be amazed as we embark on an adventure through the underwater realm they call home. So grab your snorkels and get ready to discover the secrets that lie beneath the surface. Jellyfish are prehistoric marine creatures and have been known to exist in oceans for the past millions of years, even before dinosaurs. They're absolutely fascinating, elegant, and mysterious when you see them gliding through the water. However, if you take a jellyfish out of the water, it loses its charm and simply becomes a less interesting flaw. This happens because jellyfish are made up of a whopping 95% water. But despite their name, jellyfish aren't actually fish. They're invertebrates, or animals with no backbones. Their bodies are composed of three distinct layers, an outer layer known as the epidermis, a middle layer made up of a thick, elastic, jelly-like substance called mesoglea, and an inner layer called the gastrodermis. Jellyfish eat fish, shrimp, crabs, tiny plants, and even other jellyfish. Like you can see here, a lion's main jellyfish has captured three moon jellyfish to eat. Jellyfish have a very simple digestive cavity that acts as both its stomach and intestine, with one opening to eat food and discard waste. The digestive process doesn't take very long when jellyfish eat. This quick process ensures that they can remain afloat in water. You've probably been told to be careful around jellyfish, but jellyfish don't purposely attack humans. Most stings occur when people accidentally touch a jellyfish, but if the sting is from a dangerous species, it can be deadly. The most dangerous jellyfish species are typically found in the Indo-Pacific Ocean in Northern Australia. Australian box jellyfish is the most lethal. It is the largest variety of all box jellyfish and easily identifiable by its tentacles, which bear a striking resemblance to shoelaces and can reach lengths of up to 10 feet. Consider the graceful, umbrella-like bell shape that defines many jellyfish species. This structure enables efficient movement through the water, allowing them to propel themselves with rhythmic pulsations. Additionally, their trailing tentacles play a vital role. Not only do they assist with propulsion and navigation, but they are also equipped with specialized cells called cnidocytes, which contain venomous harpoons used to capture prey or defend against predators. Some jellyfish are clear, but others are in vibrant colors such as pink, yellow, blue, and purple, and often are luminescent. Through a remarkable sequence of genetic changes, jellyfish develop the ability to produce light. These captivating displays are the result of complex chemical reactions within specialized cells called photocytes. These cells contain light-producing molecules, such as luciferin, which, when combined with oxygen, generate a luminescent glow. Bioluminescence provides jellyfish with numerous advantages. Some species use it to attract prey, using their radiant glow as a lure. Others deploy it as a defense mechanism, confusing predators or signaling danger. And that's a wrap on our jellyfish journey. We've dived into the fascinating world of these unique creatures, and it's been a blast swimming alongside them. From their translucent bodies to their graceful movements, they truly are nature's underwater dancers. So next time you're at the beach or visiting an aquarium, keep an eye out for these gelatinous wonders. I hope you've had as much fun learning about jellyfish as I've had sharing their story with you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comment section below. If you found this video helpful, please be sure to share it with others. Until then, keep exploring the wonders of the ocean.